Hello guys, welcome to Maryland and Harold Blogs. Don't forget uh don't forget to go to the channel and click subscribe, hit the notification bell. Um right now I am using the Samsung A32 5G and in this video basically I'm just gonna do a 5G test uh, how good how good is Metro with the 5G well let's find out uh, right now I'm outside my house <clears throat> and uh, we're gonna play a couple videos let's see how fast it is uh, and then I'll give you my my feedback on it so far okay uh once you click subscribe don't forget to like my videos um so like as we see there we click and it doesn't take very long to start playing so let's click another one it's pretty fast it's pretty fast the signal is pretty good the 5g is responsive and quick no buffering so far that's what that's what i like about it it's pretty it's pretty good responsive so far The sound quality is pretty loud. Um, another thing that I like about it, uh, right now I'm outside and it's pretty sunny. And as you can see right here, I have uh, the screen brightness and it's all the way up. So I like that it's, the screen is bright. It's clear. I can see good. <clears throat> and here is the phone. Uh, this is the phone that I got. I actually I actually switched to them so I ended up just paying a hundred around a hundred and two dollars basically for the month in activation and uh, they even gave me a free they even gave me a free uh, case so overall the metro the metro signal is pretty good I think I give it a 10 um, this comes with a 48 megapixel quad system. It has 64 gigabytes of storage, but it is expendable to one terabyte. That's the only thing I don't really like that. It doesn't have a lot of memory, but um, it's all good. I have an SD card. Um, the display is a 6.5 high definition Infinity V. And it does come with the 5000 battery and fast charger but it does take about an hour and a half to charge so mm, on the charging side I'll probably give it a 6 I mean it's not too good it's not too bad um, it is 5G capable so that's another that's another that's another reason I switched cuz you know it was pretty good um right here they gave it three stars out of five i mean it depends what, what you want it for it does have a decent camera it's 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 not too great but um i'll probably give it two or three stars uh if you're looking for something that's cheap uh, but you know you can watch videos and stuff like that then it's pretty good because the speakers on it is pretty good. The camera is is the camera is not so bad, but it's not the best. <clears throat> I'm gonna see if I I'm gonna see if it allows me to share it here. This is what it comes on the uh, type of camera modes. You have slow motion and you have a night mode. 
which that's okay uh, the slow motion only lets you uh, shoot through the back cameras and it only does um, I think it might be unlimited now I can do a test later to see how long it'll let me record the slow motion video which it looks like it is um, it it doesn't have any settings for it doesn't have any settings for that tell you like how uh, slow it is or to change the speed on it so it is very simple uh, the camera modes you have a portrait you have on That's basically it. It's a pretty basic phone, but it's pretty good after all. And the metro, the metro service that comes with it, I, uh, it's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. It's it's fast. I have no complaints right now so far with metro. <clears throat> Let's click another one here. Let's see if it's still going. Let's see. Now, it took a little longer right there. Well, let's go back. Let's do it one more time. Let's go. That was pretty fast. Let's go again. Oop. Let's go again. No, play. Okay, well, that's it for this video. P please like the video, comment, subscribe, uh, help us out. Thanks for the 111 subscribers. I will have more videos coming soon. Thank you.